And the funny part is I was dead stuck because I didn't know if you could hear it this or not. What but watching this back, it's like, nah, you, heard that you dead heard it. But, um, let me tell y'all about this story time YouTube. real quick. I'm not even going to tell y'all. I'm going to just let the video tell y'all. Um, even though I'm still telling the story. It's Sunday. Off rip, I got a story time. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If not, welcome back. Feel me? Um, I'm on my way to brunch right now, right? Well, now I am on my way to brunch, feel me? Um, before that, you know, feel me? It's Sunday. I had a, 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 a nice week, nice productive week. So I'm like, I bet. Let's enjoy ourselves this week. Um, let's, let's enjoy ourselves today. I got a haircut, as you can see. Feel me? Fresh cut. Fresh cut. I got a haircut. Feel me? I got a haircut. Um, I didn't get a retwist. I wanted to get a retwist, but I ain't had time. But fuck it. I'm, I'm jacking this bun. Y'all jacking this bun? Drop a like if you jocking this button, feel me? Um, yeah, so let's go to the story. I got my hair cut, feel me? I'm getting ready. My parents just came home from their little trip, whatever, feel me? We all, like, we wasn't even talking. Niggas is just going about their day. Not doing nothing extra, just being regular people. I'm backing out my fucking driveway, right? And my senses is going off, right? And I'm like, I'm looking at my mirror and there's nothing coming. Like, I don't, not nothing coming, but like, I don't see nothing blocking my way, you know, feel me, that's stopping me. But my senses is going off and it's getting faster and faster. So I'm like, wait, something's not right. I just put my foot on the brake. I ain't even get fully out my driveway yet. I just put my tail out, feel me? Actually, I did put my, I, I, got, I got a good a portion out. That's why I feel me. I'm close to the fucking, I'm close to a car, but I'm not close enough where that shit should start beeping. So now I'm looking at the mirror like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I know my car's not bugging. Moral of the story, somebody dead smacked me. So that shit go, and I'm like, what the fuck? That shit's like, and I heard it. I'm like, are you serious? And I'm looking at my mirror. I'm like, nobody's in my sight. I look to my left. The bitch is backing up. So I said, she just touched me. She just touched me. So I'm looking at the sign on my rear. I'm like, I hope it's not nothing crazy because I'm, I'm backing on my driveway and I'm barely moving like any type of speed. So, um, she hit me more of the story. I hop out the car to see what the fuck was up. Feel me? To see what the fuck was up. I see a little scratches and you know, my shit like popped out. So it semi popped out. So I was like, no fucking way this bitch just hit me. I didn't say nothing though. I walked up to her car calm. I didn't I didn't get to say nothing. She said, she's Jamaican. She's like, yo, I never touch your car, I never touch your car. Don't say I touch your car. I'm like, yo, miss. Relax. Relax. I never said you touched my car, but that's all she was implying. I never touched your car, I never touched your car. I'm like, yo. Easy. Feel me, that's all like in my head, I'm just thinking easy, ma, cause I'm like, yo, you dad just touched my car and I'm tired of like these little mini ass accidents, bro. Feel me, they don't even be worth the time, but it's just like my car is that as valuable and I don't got time to be coming out of pocket, my pockets, feel me, to fix some dumb shit somebody could have avoided yourself if you was fucking paying attention, feel me? So, she just kept getting louder and louder and louder talking about she didn't touch my car. So then, I got upset too, because you're not about to sit here and fucking, like, I'm coming out the fucking crib, bro, talking about, I hit you, nigga, you ran into me, like, there was just no explaining that shit. And like, she knew she was wrong, bro. And I was like, yo, you wouldn't be having all this fucking energy if you know you wasn't wrong. You just don't, I like, I don't want to go through insurance neither, but you fucking moving like this, bro, is not the fucking answer. Like, it's not getting you nowhere. So for me, more of the story, I popped my shit back in to see what the really fuck was going on. I, I dusted the shit off, for me. It was a little, it's, it's scratches still there, but it's not like nothing that, you know, no parts is broken. Now, my biggest thing is, I don't know if y'all can hear me or not. Let me roll the window up. I was doing it for the lighting, but this story is important. 
my biggest thing is my car my car right now is the biggest asset I have. I don't have no I don't have no house, I don't have no liability, I don't own nothing else. You feel me? Well I know I own a lot of other stuff. But this car right now, God forbid anything happens to me, I can sell it and feel me, I'll be a okay, feel me still for a year or two, whatever. But you know, feel me, I'll just be okay, feel me. Assets is important to have. And this is my biggest asset. So anytime something happens to it, whether it's inside or out, I get upset because the value depreciates, feel me? And as I just said, I'm not trying to come out of pocket for something I didn't do. As well as um, if insurance fixes it, it still depreciates because you know now you have to report it and it's going on your car facts and what, you know, X, Y, Z. That happened, I wiped it off, dusted out, feel me? At the end, she wiped her car off, talking about she ain't touch my shit, but she she dusted the same shit. The same shit I dusted, she dusted her shit off too to make sure her shit was okay. And niggas went about our day. But that shit really didn't sit right with me. And it still doesn't sit right with me because it's like, you knew you was wrong. I didn't even, and then you, you mad at me. You knew you was wrong and you're mad at me. Like, people are so fucking wicked, yo. Red light and speed limit camera ahead. Fucking Jamaicans getting loud with me oh you have a lexus girl like i got infinity you got a lexus like some people don't value their shit like at all like that shit, that shit didn't sit right with me like i'm not a car person but i know you wasn't driving no bum ass shit to be moving doing dumb shit like that like that it just didn't sit right with me but y'all we on our way to this brunch. Um, we on our way to this brunch. And yeah, stay tuned. We're gonna. I'm gonna show y'all the clips that I, you know I have. Um, yeah, on to the next event. So boom, we started off at Lucky's. Um, I was dumb late, so that's why I said we started off at Lucky's. Oh yeah, it's Sunday by the way. So feel me, this is the inside, feel me, uh a nice ambiance, that's what y'all call it, or whatever. I give it like a um it's small, but I give it a, a seven out of ten. I give it a seven out of ten. It is a nice brunch spot. You know, I didn't get to eat, but they did um give me a mimosa on the house. Here is me recording my own content because I don't have no friends and I have to take my own pictures. So I'm going to show you how I do my own shit for me. Set your phone up on a little um, street pole, whatever. Nice lighting. Record your video in 60 frames per second so that way you can slow it down if you want to. Chop it up, you know, do a couple poses. Y'all see me. Dee -dee -dee. Like, nah, let me stop. <laughs> but yeah, that has be vibing by myself type shit. Feel me? Um... What you see is what you get. Ain't much you really say. I'm just starting to do these voiceovers so that way, like, y'all really, like, feel me? Yo, no funny shit. Get me to 3,000 followers on Instagram. Link is in the bio. I'm almost there. Feel me? All right, so now on to the next spot. This car was wildin'. Like, what you beeping for? But yeah, we on the block with this spot. That's what it looked like inside. Nice ambiance, um, I guess. <laughs> I'll give this like, it's very vibey. It's not much inside, but it's vibey. Like, definitely island vibes. I'm gonna give you a little walk through the spot. Don't make it hot. You know, feel me, excuse me. Before I go any further, this is not the spot to come to by yourself. Like, I mean, it is a spot, but it's just like, it's not the spot. Like, as you can see, everybody's with their friends. They with a group of people, you know, they chilling. Like, me as a person who go out by themselves, like, I personally, like, I would just get my drink, my food, say hi and bye. Like, I couldn't just sit here by myself. Here I go, enjoying my own company. I, you know, I had to smoke outside and then somebody asked me to take their picture. And me as a photographer, I'm like, yeah, sure. Uh, 
for me. I didn't even tell them I was a photographer or nothing, but uh, I just started taking their pictures. Robin. I ain't gonna hold you. I was fake sleeping on the haircut, but shout out to the barber because that clean looking. I said that clean looking fade. That fade looking clean. Now let me stop. I'll be yo say I'll be saying shit backwards, y'all. Is that like a disorder or something? Am I the only one? Like who else does that? Or like if it's really a disorder, put me on. Cause I feel like I'll be bugging with that and it comes out so naturally. I don't know, but back to the vlog. Let me show y'all my drink real quick for me. Uh, it was a ginger beer. No, not ginger beer. Rum and ginger. Dark rum and ginger beer. Where something tropical. It was all right. I ain't gonna hold you. It's definitely all right. Needed like a little more sweetness, but it did its job. It was a good starter. Son, this is why I hate going out by myself sometimes. Like, I wasn't even by myself. I, I wasn't smoking with nobody. I wasn't doing nothing. I'm just looking around at everybody doing their own conversation. Then when I'm staring into space, I look fucking crazy. Like, well, I don't care if I look crazy, but I be feeling crazy because it's just like. I don't know. I don't like being in my head, but we getting out of that. Me and my new friends, y'all, a shot o'clock, feel me? What a great way to introduce each other. And, you know, the good vibes and stuff like that. I had to get permission to record them first because, you know, I don't know people and people don't like being on camera and shit. But, shot o'clock, let's get it. Let's get it, let's go. Yeah. Y'all heard that? Yeah, that was an alcohol hit in the screen. No funny shit. I feel like tequila is the only drink that would do that. But now nah, everybody started going off in the camera like that. Like, yeah, go. I love creating memories like this. Well, not even like this, but in general, creating memories. But nah, this fake got to me. Cause how the only food y'all sell is beef patties. I ain't gonna count. That shit was good. Don't get me wrong. That shit was great. It was giving golden crust. And I got a margarita for like my drink number four. But the fuck? They're making it hard for me. Hey, I was dead tight cause I was dead ready to go. I wasn't ready to go. I'm sorry. But um, I had to go, I guess. Feel me? And they started playing the jams. Like, I was super vibey out there. Like, the fuck? This is definitely a spot I will come back to. Love is right. Beef patties and the drinks was good. I think they only spent $25 this day. Yeah, my bill was like $25. I have fun. It was a blast. I had about like. I had three drinks for the day. Um, a mimosa, ginger beer, rum, and a margarita. And I feel nice. I'm not fully intoxicated. You know, my car's over there. Feel me? Almost lost me. But yo, um, I think I gotta pee. Kinda. Um,. If you like this video, oh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe for me. The spot is Lovers Rock. Um, hold on, I'm about to get in the car. Alright, y'all, so I'm back in the car for me. Um, yeah, today was a blast. I ain't gonna hold you. I had fun. If y'all can see, feel me. Um, nice spot. I would definitely come back. Like, very social drinks is you know it's nice you know regular price um they have regular drinks they have their specialty drinks um very vibey out here you know feel me i would say a judge freeze zone 
and I like, you know, that's the type of environments I like being around. If you are new or, you know, if you, you know, back to my channel for me. Um, I like judge free zone, judge meant free zones. So yeah, um, if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'll be just posting my, my weekly uh, vlogs and shit. Weekly vlogs, um, daily vlogs, 